Hey, welcome to another episode of Jake's Makes, and today I'm working on a tail light lens for my 1953 Hudson Jet. And if you've never heard of a Hudson before, I honestly wouldn't be surprised because they went out of business in about 1955-56. Um, and if you have heard of it, then maybe you've watched the, uh, the Cars movies put out by uh, Disney's Pixar, where there's a... Uh, Hudson Hornet, you know, is like the the main character for the uh, the movie, and Hudson has a pretty big NASCAR history. But, anyways, I'll bring you out here and show you. So here she is. She's pretty old. Got a lot of old parts and things like that, and I kind of wanted to make a new tail light lens for it. These ones are getting kind of cracked and, you know, not really looking so good. But I also figured in uh, kind of like old hot rotting style, you know, making making a new one, making it kind of uh, a little bit more flashy and uh, cool looking. So. Um, here's some examples off of uh, Google for old taillight lenses and stuff like that from the era. And these were all factory. But the one that I thought was pretty cool is the, um, the old Cadillac. And uh, they just kind of look like, you know, torpedoes coming off of the back of the, uh, back of the car. So what I did, and here's the, here's the stock one. And pretty much all I ended up doing was taking some measurements off of, you know, these mounting holes here and uh, with my trusty calipers and just dumping those dimensions into Fusion 360. And do a with that sketch there, but essentially you can kind of see you know, there's the hole, there's the hole, there's another hole. Uh, you can set the different thicknesses of the plastic. I'm probably going to end up playing with that a little bit later because this cone, I'm not exactly sure how well the light is going to be able to pass through it. But anyways, um, so you would just press uh, 3D print right here at the top and export it to Cura. And right about now we're looking at three hours and six minutes. So at this point we're an hour and 38 in. So I'll be posting an update once this prints with it uh, hopefully installed on the car. And uh, if I'm not too crazy about the design, maybe I'll change it up. But if you like the video, please like and subscribe. Thanks for watching.